Good morning, guys. Been really excited to do this video today because we've got brand new metrics uh, and actually buy limits and live trade set setups for EOS. So I'm going to dive in here because I'm jacked about this. Okay. You guys know this. If you've seen this before, we are currently 91 for 91 wins on this channel. We have never lost a crypto trade. I'll show you guys in the second half of this video, how to get over here. So you guys can take advantage of all of our wins. Um, but I want to first dive into the analysis of EOS guys. I'm not going to spend too much time on this, this video talking about the bullish exchange. I just did a video recently. I think it was literally yesterday on EOS. Um, so you guys can watch us. I, Point being, I'm still bullish on the bullish exchange. I am still bullish on EOS. Now we saw a great move up here the other day, but guys, if you have our indicators, this isn't a surprising drop. Like I don't want anyone to be surprised about this. You shouldn't be. Why do we get this drop? It's pretty simple. We had the trend exhaustion as well as the well money flow push up into higher sections and we couldn't go any higher. So simple, like the indicators are calling the drops in here, guys. Previous time before that, how could we call the drop? We saw trend exhaustion push up in the top red section for a while, as well as the well money flow up here. This is how we ended up getting the drop back down. We were able to call this drop as well. If you guys are following me on this channel, when the well money flow was high, as well as the trend exhaustion was hovering into the top red sections, we could not head up any higher. That's where we dropped back down. We then ended up seeing this come out here and we ended up not heading up too much further at all. And we started seeing the drop down from here. This is how we are literally predicting these markets here before anyone else. And why we're able to have a hundred, literally, <laughs> it's kind of funny. Can I just say this real quick, guys? I was talking to someone yesterday and they're like, you know, it would actually be maybe a little bit better for marketing if you were to come out and show a loss. And I'm like, I totally understand that because at some point when we actually hit like 100, I'm not saying we will, we might take a loss, but if we ever hit like 125 for 125 wins, it might actually be unbelievable for some people. But here's the thing, guys, I, I, <laughs> I'm going to just be honest with where we're at. So if we have never lose a trade, I'm not going to show a loss, but it's kind of funny that like we're getting up into such high win rates over here that people haven't seen this before. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. I need to drink more water in the morning. I think we're getting up to uh, possibly a record for on YouTube here of the most wins ever taken on crypto. Um, so as that starts getting higher, I just want to keep transparency with you guys. Of I'm keeping track of every single trade, even trades that we've been holding since October 29th, and it's December 9th in here. It's, it's like... I'm keeping everything transparent. I promise that for you guys. Let's keep going over EOS. Let, guys, you want to just dive into the metrics? I want to do that because it'd be kind of fun. Make sure you guys have the price versus well money flow trend exhaustion on your charts because here's what I'm watching for. Now that we're moved into the bottom red section and we're getting the money flow heading low here, this is where I'm going to be watching for possible moves back up now. Well, why? Look to see what happened last time we got down here and look how accurate this is. Obviously, the flash crash ended up pumping us back up. Let's take a normal market scenario. Got to the bottom section here with the trend exhaustion, the well money flow was low. What happened? We could not head any lower and we started to move back up. Even over here, it didn't take too long before us just moving back up even a little bit. Now, I'm not looking for this to be like, okay, we hit the bottom, we immediately shoot up. But a lot of times that's actually what's happening is we're not staying at these lower levels. We are actually saying, hey, the well money flow is low. The trend exhaustion is low. Prices are dipping out. Watch for the pump. Watch for the pump. And we get the pumps. Well, money flow is low. Trend exhaustion is low. Awesome. We got a pump. Like literally every time we are seeing this happen here, we are getting pumps in the market. Some of them are 15, 20%. Some of them are four to 5%. But the thing is, we are literally calling market drops and market pumps before they happen on this channel with these two indicators. It's so incredible. It's just really with fun, honestly, at the end of the day. All right, guys, dun, dun, dun. brand new metrics for EOS. I really like these a lot. So let's take a look at this. 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. These are all going to update, which is literally in 26 minutes. So let's dive in. It's like getting a brand new car. We get to look at some cool stuff in here. So as far as the emotional index yesterday, because obviously these are yesterday's metrics and they're going to update in 25 minutes here, we we're sitting in the neutral section. This makes sense to me because EOS was not crashing. It was not breaking highs. It was right between this high and the low. So that's, that's where we're at. Very neutral. Okay. Very, very powerful, very powerful metric over here. When you see retail traders getting excited, that's where we're going to be selling our trades because institutions will, sh will trade against them and drop the market. When you see retail traders getting very anxious in the market and even fearful, this is where we're buying because that's when the price is going up. That's when the price is going up, price is going up, price is going up, price is going up. Okay. This is pretty crazy. This is the only time in this last flash crash where we ended up seeing the market continue to go down. All right. Watch this though. What we're seeing down here is very, very active blockchain trades for EOS. This is really fun to watch because this thing is really active all over the place, which can help us predict some moves. With the price going up recently, what we ended up seeing was short trades increasing while long trades moved out of the market. 
okay? This, I do believe, helped push us into this drop here, okay? If we take a look at what's happening recently, as of yesterday, I, what we're seeing is long trades move back into the market, which I believe they're looking to try to continue to buy the dip because we are at such a ridiculously low price here, guys. Like, this is where we came from, up here. Like, we have buy limits that got hit way, way down here at like, what was it? $2.52. 252 is one of the buy limits I personally got in with you guys. Like, this is where we're at. Who cares if we move down a little bit? Like, these are the targets that I'm looking for as far as moves up when the bullish exchange is, is launched to the US. Like, let's be patient. This could be a massive, massive coin. That's why we have metrics for it. Okay, so watch this. If we start seeing long trades increase here and short trades continue to move out, that's actually very bullish because people don't think it's gonna head down any further for short trades. Long trades increasing will actually shoot us back up here. You guys want me to show you something? Watch this real quick too. I can see this on the chart, so I wanna show this to you guys. Take a trend line, go like this, and go up until you hit something. Boom, there you go, we hit something. <laughs> we have broken down below this, but I want you guys to watch to see because we're at the strong structure support right here. We could be bouncing back off this and heading back up. We're also at the bottom where we've moved up literally every single time. So watch for a correction in EOS. Yes, we may head down here to about 310, 315, but watch for the bounce back up on EOS. Let's continue here with the metrics. What we're seeing here is we are simply in a good long trade section here. This is where you guys want to be paying attention. Now, it, it, it's kind of funny. It, this follows the price structure really well, but this has nothing to do with price. This is actually coded based off behavior of the market. When you guys look at this chart, this is not a this is not charting price. This is charting behavior. You guys need to understand that. If it was charting price, I could literally just throw a price up here and say, "Hey, you know, the price is now 450." No, that's not it. What we're charting over here and what these candles are is simply charting behavior. Once you understand this is behavior and this is emotions driving the market and not necessarily um financials, I understand there's a little bit of that, but it is more emotions, guys, than anything, and that's why we look at the emotional index and why we trade against all retail traders and we're doing really well. Okay, look at this metric value. I've actually never had um, this metric shoot up to 1400 before. That's because the drop on EOS was insane on this drop back down. We ended up getting picked up at this bottom level and that drop was crazy to watch. I literally, <laughs> I was like watching Shark Tank and I was also um, watching this at the same time. And I'm just like, I'm watching Shark Tank. These guys make these crazy deals. And I'm like, I'm literally a, a shark right now. I'm like Mark Cuban right now buying this like crazy business that's gonna explode. I'm like putting $50,000 into the exchange and I'm just writing this thing back up. So it's been really, really fun. Full disclosure, the current trade that I'm in is currently down 7.64%. So I wanna be honest about that. I'm waiting for this to come back into the profit and get up to about this buy limit here and then I'll probably take 25 to 50% exit. That will give us about 30% profit on EOS. Guys, if EOS does any type of move like this over here in the market and we shoot up, I wanna give you guys some perspective here. This is why I love this. Here's a shot up in the market. I'm not gonna pull the top. That's a 32% move. Okay, let's take a look at another one. Let's take a look at when this thing moves, does it actually move? Yes, it does. That's 22% move in the market. Let's take a look at another one of these moves. The volatility on this is super, super nice. Look at this move here. There was that 34%. 34% moves. We have yet to see a very nice pump back up in the market. We got this one over here, but I do think we're due for another one, which if we come out here and we look at this, as far as going from here to a 32% move, 35, that's where I have my target up here where we could be looking at about a 473 exit before the psychological level of 475. All right. Let's continue here and I'll show you guys how to get into the next buy limits. All right, I love that we have metrics for this. I'm like, it's like a kid in a candy shop. This is so much fun. What I'm looking for as far as they move up here is a breakdown at around 417, okay? 417 puts us right around the structure high here. So this is where I'm looking at as far as a breakdown if we move back up. Now, as far as a support, the greatest one sits at $2.80. $2.80 is right around this area. So yes, we could come back down to this area and if we do, Watch, literally 30 seconds here, I'll get you guys into the next buy limits and I'll show you how to do that. Maybe 60 seconds. <laughs> this comes out here and shows you guys if you want a dollar cost average into EOS, great places to just pick it up on discount. On discount, on discount, on discount. You guys can hold for five to 10, 15, 20, 30 years, doesn't matter. This chart looks a little deceiving. It looks like this is the high. Guys, EOS is the only coin within the top 10 coins, and I know EOS is not in the top 10, but based off the top 10 coins, they all hit an all-time high in this last uh, a bull run, right? Did EOS? No, EOS did not hit an all-time high. I think this is one of the sleepers that can get incredible uh, 
incredibly bullish if you just are patient on this coin. And that's why I'm in here, we're trading this. Okay, exit points, perfectly calling out the exit here. This shows us where we're like, hey, if we're moving up here, you might wanna look for a drop back down because we could possibly see a drop back down. For some reason, the metrics are just working really, really well on this coin. I think it possibly has something to do with the volatility, but, but don't hold me, told me that I'm not 100% sure. What we saw yesterday was this saying, hey, this might be looking for a move down, actually calling this move down here perfectly. Also the trend exhaustion, price versus well money flow. Guys, get these on your charts. This is what's calling drops in the market. This is how I'm able to call exits here, okay? I didn't call an exit yesterday because I'm not exiting for 7.9%. I'm gonna exit for something like 25 or 30%. This is why we can get more profits out of lower coins because we're starting at a lower level. All right, let me show you guys how to do this. Here's how you get to our next trades for EOS because I think EOS is gonna be the one. Guys, we make more money percentage on EOS than any of the other coins we trade. Why? Because the structures and momentum are going to give us more money because we're starting at a lower price, okay? Case in point, watch this. Ethereum, if you come over here and you take a look at Ethereum and you look at the price range from the dip to the pump back up here, what was it? Let's call it 15%. Awesome, okay, now let's come over here to EOS and take a look at the bottom of the pump and we're gonna move it from the bottom back to the top. We're gonna take a price range and we're gonna look at somewhere around the bottom to where we were. 15%, 51% increase. This is why it's a very incredible coin. I'm gonna be trading it and I literally have like the account, the count's down this morning. Obviously everything's down, but let me show you guys. My number one holding, I, I know I'm making this a long video. I have 25, one quarter of my, a, Complete trading balance is in EOS right now. My cash is still at 40%, guys. I do believe we could still see a crash back down. As the market goes up and we hit our buy limits, this is easily gonna be pushing into about $100,000, probably $100,000, $5,000, maybe $10,000. I'm waiting for the market to really start pumping back up. We are still somewhat in this bearish market. While we're here, guys, don't worry about your account going down, I don't care. We should be concentrating on putting buy limits in the market and getting set up for trades in here so we can make money for when the market reverses. This thing is not gonna go down forever. So please get buy limits set up and we can ride this up when we do see nice bull runs like we did in this market over here. Time to buy. All right, let's do this. Let me show you guys how to get into these trades. It is $49 a month for our membership. This will give you guys access to all of our metrics, including EOS now, and it will also give you guys access to all of the uh, the buy limits, okay? Here's what you can do. Sign up over here. This is gonna be going up in price. Come to the live trade section. All of our 91 wins that we've ever taken have been called out on this single page, and this is where I take all of my buy limits as well for my personal Coinbase portfolio in here, okay? Here's what you guys are gonna do. EOS is at the bottom down here. Just click this, come all the way down to the bottom and click it and you guys are gonna be great. Awesome. This is what you guys wanna do with EOS and all of our coins. I'm gonna show this to you and this is how you guys are gonna trade with us. I'm not your financial advisor. I wanna make that very clear. Please consult a financial advisor before entering this trade. I, I just need to make that clear because I'm just a YouTuber and we've just never lost a trade, okay? Take a look at this. What you guys are gonna do is you're gonna check every morning at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time because this is when our metrics update. If the lines do not update, this is because the first buy limit is still the best, all right? This will change to 12 nine this morning. Follow me here. Let's say you guys have $1,000 you wanna enter this market with on any of our coins. Great, split your trade allotment on the coin, we're gonna use Bitcoin for an example, into four equal portions of $250 each. That's 25% of $1,000. 250 will go here at this price, 250, 250, 250. You guys have the buy limits as well as the prices labeled. This is so ridiculously clear and easy. Set up your buy limits. Once your first buy limit is hit, set a sell limit in your exchange at this price for 100% exit. Do not move any of the buy limits once the first buy limit gets hit. These buy limits are gonna update on this chart because we have new traders every single day coming to this channel and this always shows the best next trade to take. So if you guys get paid this Friday and you have more money you wanna put into the market, don't use the buy limits that you're currently using for past trades. Come here and look at the new buy limits because that's gonna give you guys the most updated um, buy limits for that day, the best risk management for that trade, okay? Once you do that, come down here, sign up in Telegram on your personal phone or your computer first and click this link right here where it says Telegram channel here. That will open up a page on our site that's for members only and it will give you guys access straight into the Telegram channel where we pushed over 3,500 members. This is where I'm giving you guys detailed analysis of why I'm exiting, how I'm taking profits. Guys, we took a 26% profit. Like, where was this? It was 26% profit on Matic. Um, and I was in this with you guys. 26.74% profit on Matic we took. I think this was literally just, this was either yesterday or the day before. Um, incredible exit here. And if you guys know what happened to Matic, we ended up dropping back down. So, 
that was a very good exit when you get, if you guys are watching that, let's take a look at Matter real quick, just, just for fun. We ended up dropping back down, that's what I was calling, and so I got back into the buy limit, and this is where we're currently sitting with an incredible entry. Guys, we didn't FOMO in like a lot of other people. We didn't get into the top up here of all-time highs. We waited and we were patient. We got this on discount for 12% discount. This is why you guys need to be trading over here. I, Guys, I'm putting all my money where my mouth is. Like, I, I, I wanna be this guy on YouTube that's like, you know what, there's a lot of people out here that, that may, they may be able to code indicators, That that's fantastic, okay. But are they actually trading with their real money and getting behind here and, and getting in the trenches with you guys? And I, I, it's, hard, it's weird to say this. this, I was gonna say to feel the emotions you guys feel. Guys, I don't get emotional about trading. That's the one reason why I, I feel like I, I, it's good that I'm, you know, the guy that created this is I don't get emotional. I literally just let all of my buy limits get hit, okay? Let them get hit. When it goes down, get excited if you want to get emotional. If it goes up, watch the channel over here where we're exiting. Like, this is more robotic. And I'll leave you guys with this. When trading becomes boring, that is when it becomes profitable. I know you guys love getting emotional, and I know you guys love the jackpot wins, and I know you guys like to do this because it's emotionally stimulated. I'm doing this to make money. I'm not doing this to get a high out of life. Like I've got my baby, I've got my golden retriever and I've got vacations I can take on. I've got my wife, like I've got my family and my friends. Those are the things that are getting me jacked in life. This here is like, I'm excited for you guys. Like my enthusiasm I have on here is from people trading for a living now and people actually being able to send money overseas. I've got people telling me that they're trading with our strategy. They're sending their money overseas to help buy food for their family. Like it is crazy, like almost makes me emotional like thinking about it, like it's awesome. Guys like this in here who are like, I'm up 50%, I'm not using leverage and I've done 25 or 25 wins from the last six weeks. This guy makes himself $20,000 using two indicators on our, our um, on the indicators that we have here. Let me just scroll down here for something else. It's just completely random. This guy does 17,000 euro in a single day. Let's scroll down to something else. This guy does 372% profit in less than 24 hours. Yes, he's using leverage, I don't recommend it, but I want to point that out there because I know some of you are. $1,100 profit on VET. Scroll down here. Eight for eight wins in the last two weeks since I started growing. Up 8.6%. That's fantastic. Guys down here doing 2K in the morning on that trade. Thank you. This guy down here does 6,000 profit on Solana and $10,000 on ADA based off the trades that we called. It is insane what people are doing. $7,000 here. I know this is maybe boring for some of you guys. This is why I get jacked. Guys, yes, we have people making $60,000 plus on some of these trades because they have ridiculous accounts. I, I, I help clients that have millions and millions of dollars. $500 is amazing. Don't underestimate this. Of If you guys make $500, you're doing great. Our account was up $4,000 in the last 12 hours. And yes, we're pulling back down here because the market's dipping. But let's hold for the greater profits. Four to 5K um, based off for Jessica. Like, great job, Jessica. You're doing fantastic. All right, I'm gonna leave it here because I don't want to, you guys can look at this. Literally, this guy did $60,000 in a single trade because I actually coach him as one of the clients that I coached. So it, just incredible. Anyways, make sure you guys are getting the membership set up. Make sure you guys are getting the buy limit set up and then follow me in the Telegram channel over here with the indicators and make sure you guys are getting this because this literally is 81% off for all of our indicators here. Normally, you guys want to just get the price versus one money flow, trend dashboard, and trend exhaustion. Those are the ones I use. Guys, get the other ones in here because you're going to get six plus indicators on here and plus you're going to get 81% off instead of 58 to 60% off the ones you need anyways. So just save yourself another 21%. On top of this, I'm gonna up the price of these three indicators in the next three months. So you're just gonna get appreciating value if you get this right now. No brainer, snag that, it's in the description of this YouTube video. It's also in the first comment of the YouTube video. God bless you guys so much. I'm not nervous whatsoever about this market dropping down here. I get more excited because that means more buy limits will get hit, more money will get in the market, and you guys will be able to get up into the profit. Enjoy the metrics, guys, for EOS and get into those EOS trades with four different buy limits right now so you guys can watch this. It's right down here. Click in here. You guys will probably get triggered in today. And um, make sure you guys are watching that. God bless you guys so much. Everything you need is in the description, the indicators and metrics. Get those before they go up in price. Get the buy limit set up. Get into the Telegram channel. And I will see you guys on the next video. God bless you guys. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.